How are you holding up? It's hard when you can't trust your own memory, isn't it? Are you all right? Don't swim in the river. The fumes will kill you. Could be worse, I think. The Bobbies have a first on them, you know. No, uh, just rest in my feet. Well, nothing lasts forever, does it? If you get a cut out here, you'd better bandage it up. You can get an infection just from a scratch. One day we'll all just look back at this and laugh. To sleep, perchance to dream.
It's actually sort of pretty at night. In a fatal sort of way. Better get indoors! Getting away from it all, 1964 edition, by Mr. William Kite. Some sort of travel guide. No one travels. Which means this is something else. That seems to be a guide to surviving the Garden District. How useful. But who is Mr. Kite? Bloody hell, I've forgotten about the revolvers. If I go through without taking my joy, I'm gonna get spanked. 
I better run like hell when it lets me out. We'll be off now. Oh dear. One bridge down, and I'm off to the train station. This is where we hang them, isn't it? They broke into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want the Germans to be angry, did we? We were so scared, or maybe just so tired, so we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. <gasps> I hope that's the worst thing I remember, says the chap heading to the train station. Oh, what lovely memories are waiting for me there. At least I can get on the train tracks there and get the hell out of town. Now I just need to find the train station. I want to be able to see it from a distance. And here we are. Not quite as grand as it used to be. Of course, there hasn't been a train since the germs left. Still, the tracks go from here all the way to the bridge, and then across the river. And then all over Britain. 
I wonder if Prue made it this far. I wonder why Mr. Kite sent her to the Garden District at all. She could have just popped over the bridge from the station at Apple Hole. What are we going to do if there isn't food? Will you shut it? I'm trying not to blow myself up. Hey, lock up your board bags. I'll piss in your corpses. <laughs> We're coming for you, you greedy bastard! Go eat a banger, you leaky scanner! You're done hoarding all the V-meat! Sorry to bother. Just looking. Please just lie down. How do I get down to the tracks? 
nothing personal. This won't take a minute. No one saw me hide. I bet I could stay here forever. At least until I starved to death. Won't hurt a bit.
that's how I get down. Right. Huh. Now I'll just have to find the tracks and walk on out of Wellington Wells. I'm so sorry, Percy. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. The rule was if a kid was a day over 13, what could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut after and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done.
must I go with him? And you are too old to go to Germany, are you not? Please, no! He can't take care of himself! Stop him! Bloody... Bobby? I told him I wanted to board even if I was ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. I shouldn't have told him they got my birthday wrong. Don't even know why I did. Should have just kept quiet and got on the train. Bloody hell, there's been some sort of caving. So much for walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. What the fuck do I do now? Oh look, oh, shit. it's a little lost lamb. Where's Bo Peep? In your curtsy way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. Uh, 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 can we pound him now? Yep. Don't eat me meat! Don't eat it! Your fee meat! for knocking down my blocks in kindergarten. If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Thank you. 
Bloody hell. That's Ollie. Ollie! Come for me, have you? Ollie! I'm Arthur! You won't get me! You won't get me, you bastard! Ollie! No! It's Arthur! Bloody murdering wastrels! Have you gone mental? I'll save you, Margaret! I'm your old neighbour, Artie! Always lying! Little Artie! Artie's gone! They took him away! Ollie, no! They You're didn't! You're lying! You're a wastrel! Ollie, it's Arthur! Well, why didn't you see that before? Oh my god, Artie. Little Artie. Yeah, for fuck's sake. Watch your mouth, laddie. What would your mum think? I thought they took you away. No. They had my birthday wrong. What? Sorry? No, of course not. No, you've got it all wrong. That was Jack turned you in and I what tried to save you. Right. I remember now. You came back. From the station. The only one. You don't think they hurt him? Percy. The Germans aren't animals, you know. They just wanted to make sure we stay quiet. And we did. Spot of tea? Uh, that's very kind of you. I I'm not thirsty. That's right, Margaret. We have to run after water. <laughs> I have to find him. Any idea where he might be after all these years? Not really. I know I have to get out of Wellington Wells. I, th I thought I could take the train tracks to the bridge. Aye. The only way to the Britannia Bridge is the train station and the parade. And good luck getting into the parade. You could stay here. Remember when you and Sally used to stay with me? When the... It's young Artie. Meg, you remember Artie, don't you? No room at the inn for young Artie? No. You're right. You're always right. Sorry. Margaret says it's best if I keep to myself. Oh. Sorry to bother. But... Margaret thinks we could help each other. Really? Uh, brilliant. There's a warehouse. In the old German camp, we could burgle it. The Victory Memorial Camp? Where all those home army chaps run around practicing stabbing people with bayonets? What, what do you want me to do there? Run around yelling, here I am, shoot me, while you go in under the wire? There's uh, a thing I need from their warehouse. If you help me, I'll get you out of Wellington Wells. I just need you to turn off the power in the camp. And this isn't going to get me killed. Don't be a great girl's blouse. I'll meet you at the bunker after dark. Don't worry about the sentries on the bridge. I'll make sure they get a good night's sleep. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Shall I just show myself out then? Ollie? I don't actually know the way out, you know. That's Margaret, from school. Margaret, what's her name? She was supposed to go on the train, but then she disappeared and no one would talk about it. Bloody hell. Oh, bloody hell.
At least we're alive. Right. Sometimes you just have to eat rotten things. That's life, innit? What rough beast slouches towards the house of bread? 